Recording. So before you start this machine, this is the fluid power bands. We do about three, four experiments on here. Before you start the machine, you should wire a pair of safety glass. Also, if you have something like this tool toe, it's not required, but if you have one, just wire them. At least wire something that covers your toes. Mm -hmm. uh, because some of the stuffs are heavy and slippery. This is a oily machine, so if this gets dropped, then it's gonna be difficult. All right, so now let's show the different components of this. I'm gonna start this machine. So you can come close. This develops about a thousand PSI. You can control the pressure right here. There is a pressure Swiss. You can go all the way up to, it can reach over 900 PSI, almost like there. And then there are lab experiments where you have to control the pressure and take the data accordingly. So you will have to know how to control that. Basically, turning this knob, and then there is this flow control where you can open the flow all the way, where you can uh, change the flow if you want. So there are experiments where you have to control the flow and get the measurement for different flows. Mm -hmm. So here I'm gonna show you how to connect and disconnect. Now before you connect or disconnect, you should turn off the machine because the line is pressurized, so it might spill some. Uh, it's quick connect, it should not, but it's better to, you know, not to connect or disconnect when it's running. So basically what I did was, this is the this is the pressurized fluid coming from this pump using this line, and it's going to this in port of the four-way directional valve. We explain the four-way directional valve, how it works. So from the pump, so this is the pump, it's pressurizing the fluid, sending it this way, and it's connect there, and this is the out port, it's going there. This is a quick connect, disconnect, very easy. Make sure you hear it click and pull it before you start. And then, as we discussed before, this A port, there is an A and B, out of these four, in, out, and A, B. So that goes to the device. So this one, basically, I have connected to the cylinder. And then, I'm gonna start the machine and show you how to operate that. So, Now this is the centered position for it. Now it's centered. If I push this way, it's gonna go down. In one of the lab, you will be attaching some weight on the cylinder, like this one, and also this one, this way. Attaching there and getting the measurements. How much power it is transferring um, through the cylinder. Mm -hmm. So what else? So pressure, base. This also has, this best bench also has a pneumatic system. So here is a pneumatic pressure line connected here. And this is the pneumatic line. We will explain this in an, another video. How long is that? Uh, three minutes and a half. 